It's a very uh, early morning raid here. 3 3 a.m. Actually, it's about 3:20 a.m. here at uh, Occupy Honolulu corner of uh, Ward and uh, Baratania. So you're taking uh, blankets and whatnot out of the tent. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. ten police here. And, uh, unusual mix uh, in terms of uh, so once again, that's the kind of I'm a Malahoy, the law of the spinner paddle. I was going through a battle with these two fishermen. He tripped over a rock, fell down, he's trying to get up, and these two fishermen, one of them hit him in the head so hard on the head that it splintered the paddle. And he, w he went unconscious, but they didn't kill him. Embark tent right here. He could have been killed. So that's how he learned to treat, that he learned from his people. Not just from his, from his, his colleagues. The this is all in the park, uh, what they're calling park area, that's West Chun. Starting his day a little early or ending it late. Here's uh, there's the uh, public forum stuff. Thank you. That's cool. We can we can still peaceably assemble and sit on the grass. And of course, this is uh, Parks and Rec, City and County of Honolulu. Hey, bro. How are you? How's it going? To it's good. I'm chilling in my chair. Tell me. Down to come take my stuff. Tell me what's up. Tell me what Nothing. happened. Meaninglessness again. More meaninglessness. So they're going to seize your tent, or what is the deal? Uh, I don't care about this. This is meaninglessness. They can take what they want. What they do. Midori, tell, tell me what's going on. Oh, well, they showed up at 3 o'clock okay. while we are sleeping. And, but luckily, we had cleaned everything out. And, um,. Got the all our necessities and only just kept like the tents and whatever. Um, so they didn't come back 24 hours later, since it's clearly about property, right? <laughs> it is. They're taking. This is a direct uh, example of of Bill 54 not being about property, but about people and their home and their stuff. Yeah. It's the Fourth Amendment. It's the Fourth Amendment. I don't know if you guys know that one. They don't read a lot. Yeah, real garbage. So, will we get that back? Okay. No, we're not gonna get that back. They don't give nothing back. It's gonna give me a ten. Where's Sean? I just. They're not gonna give it back. Well, we're going to try to. If they give it back, they probably have smallpox or polio in it or something. Was there? Did they have? Uh, they come from somewhere else. Huh? Go sleep in them. Have they come from? Lucas. Lucas. Step back, ma'am, one more time. Step back, ma'am, one more time. That's what's done. Director of the uh, 
I'm going to give you guys a warning. You guys are obstructing. You guys are obstructing. This is a final warning. That was not intense. It was intense. This is a final warning. Please don't talk to me. Please. Okay, step back. Don't worry. Let them do this. I think you're the meanest man that I've ever met in my entire life. Taking a sign. It was not inside. That was not inside the park. We put it outside the lines for a reason. No, get a shot of the table. Oh, no. I did a really good job on it. I did not take that. I have an earlier shot to this uh, free speech table. Why are you here? Just, just, we don't need this. 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 We don't need this right now. But you're coming here to oppress it specifically at 3 o'clock in the morning, waking up kids who are trying to make the world a better place. 3 o'clock in the morning, kick them out of the tent. Not to mention the house kids. How can, how can this be home? Great. That's right. Go. Under the direction of Wes Chun, who's the director of facilities maintenance, rather than uh, Tricia Morikawa, who is Office of Housing. So this is being done under the parks or facilities. I can't That's Facilities, uh, which means it's another, uh, that's uh, Officer Santos. He's, uh, To a local police, right in the, right here. They removed free speech. Have not answered my questions about uh, reobtaining our free speech materials that they stole. They won't. You get to run around. Uh, no, no, they won't even give me the courtesy of the run around. Taking the painting? Can I can I have that painting? Can I have my free speech back? Is that okay? It's okay uh, I did that for the encampment. Uh, uh, especially have that? painted. No. It is. Uh, that it has expressive the content. The I'm not going to go into the trunk, but can I have it? No. Why can't I have it? Because it's in the trunk. Ooh. Well, I mean, it can be easily taken out of the trunk, can't it? It's not. It's not. It's not like there's some like magical force field like holding it there. It's a free speech material. It has expressive content. Yeah, I, I believe I do express a political message. Happy Vagina Ideology Day. I feel like that's a political message about Valentine's Day. Like, my rights are being violated and none of you are doing your job. Protect and serve, right? Yeah, so you can choose what free speech signs that we have out, so you can choose what things are here, so that you can, so you can selectively no, censor us. It's really, it's really nice to see cops around the signs that they don't repress it. Well, they act really, no. like, repress it. It's a really nice juxtaposition, guys. Like, you're really, like, doing the sign justice. It becomes, like, a performing art piece. It's a, perfor it's a performing art piece. Yeah, thanks for being involved. Can you guys imagine if we had no other possessions and we were actually, because of the system, uh, houseless and, and vulnerable, and they came and did this, like they have done, they swept other people's places? How then would we feel, you know? Okay, obviously a uh, mainstream press guy. They have cameras and lights, so you can see them.
so he has authorization to be inside the park. Uh, they are claiming that that is the border. Can you grab a shot of this? This is pretty nice. Right here. Some campers. This is the last of that painting that I did for the camp. They're taking it away. Probably not to store it. We're not allowed to go and get it. I've already asked for it a million times. We're not allowed to go and get it. This is not the storage truck. This is the throwaway. Hey, come here. That has expressive. That have uh, expressive content. Let go. Let go. Come on. For the record, it doesn't have a tag on it. Please. It does not have. It does not have a. Sorry, it doesn't matter. Sticker on it. It's okay. Please. Just, uh, just, I just want to put that out there. In the energy out there that it was not tagged. You don't have a thousand dollars. That's what they're supposed to be allowed. And you would uphold that law. You know. I really appreciate what you're willing to do. That was really wonderful. Thank you. Uh, I'm very happy. And there was at least just like nine and ten. So ten police officers. So we need to. Um, I'm wondering if they're going to another. <laughs> Well, could we need to know like how much money is being wasted on us? And if they're going As somewhere to, else. The, the, like the schools that got shut down. Garbage uh, containers in. Officially goes to storage for 30 days, but the recovery process is so difficult that very few people have recovered any kind of property. I think you all t shirt it out. Come on, put on a shirt for us. <laughs> did you see that? Saved it. Yeah, Very I saved good. this chair too. Oh, dude, I literally grabbed it. Very good. I saved the chair too. Not happening. Oh, did get... you have all our flyers and propaganda? I have two brand new tents here. You can tell by their square shape that they haven't been uh, haven't even been un unpacked yet I'm gonna get a better shot of that these are the embark tents that I favor they're actually pretty good they're $37 at uh, Target you can see the square shape here indicates it and the sharp corners that they haven't even been unpacked. And I'm going to take them to the corner. Now, if you're watching, uh, it's also the what I call the uh, Adopt a Tent program, which um, allows people to support Occupy by dropping off a tent and then picking it up within a 24-hour period and dropping another one off. Handing off... Uh, I really like those those tents. They're like for the, the price-performance ratio. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I've also learned how to pitch one. But, yeah, yeah. yeah so, so you can... You stay into it? No, I gotta, I gotta file this as a press release. Same, same Friday. I might, I might do that Friday. Same Friday. <laughs> what you doing Friday then? <laughs> what you got going on? <laughs> run, dog, run. <laughs> We're gonna get you to stay here. <laughs> maybe, I'll, maybe I'll sign off now and I'll, and I'll go and file this, yeah. and I'll like zoom out on this uh, and this. They left. It's part of the. It has expressive can, content can, on can it. Can I open it, please? Yeah.